Has your government considered uh, installing like a wind turbines? Well, we there are ongoing studies uh, with respect to uh, to wind. Um, on certain islands, uh, they may be viable, but we certainly don't have the kind of uh, of wind. Uh, that we would see in Aruba and other uh, Caribbean uh, islands. And so uh, studies are ongoing, um, but we're exploring um, tidal energy, OTEC, uh, uh, solar, uh, clearly, um, based on the amount of solar radiation days we have in any calendar uh, year, uh, waste to energy uh, as well. Um, and we're also looking into biomass. One last question, uh, Mr. Dorset. Uh, does the Bahamas have one uh, company that provides electricity and one that provides water or is it the same company that does both? Well currently um, the Bahamas Electricity Corporation which is a government owned corporation has a monopoly on the generation of, of power and distribution of power except for the island of Grand Bahama where there is a private entity that provides uh, power to the city of, of Freeport um, and the uh, settlements outside of, uh, of the city of Freeport on the island of Grand Bahama. Uh, and so, um, as a part of this current uh, RFP process, we intend to allow private sector to assist in the generation uh, of power through a joint venture. Um, and transmission and distribution will still be owned by the government. Uh, however, we will enter into a management contract uh, to assist us in reducing uh, the costs associated with the uh, transmission and distribution side of the business. Still one more question, Mr. Dorset. In comparison to Aruba, what is the population and the size of the island compared in compared to Aruba? Well, one, our population is about 350,000, um, and we we have we're an archipelago. And so there are literally thousands of islands and keys. Uh, uh, we have in excess of 20 uh, uh, populated islands, um, and the country spans over 100,000 square miles. Uh, and so we're not dealing with one land mass. Um, and the reality for our government is when it comes to uh, infrastructure, uh, we have to replicate that on a number of islands, which obviously creates economic challenges for the country, because instead of building one hospital, we've got to build 22. Um, and so uh, uh, those are the realities of the Bahamas. Uh, but as I said, I think that uh, the people of Aruba uh, have done a phenomenal uh, a task um, in embracing renewable energy, um, and I really commend the government and the people for doing so.